Beginning Tuesday, April 2nd, 2024, students will select the JCPS Staff and Students Login Here button to access Infinite Campus. The Infinite Campus student portal shows student assignments, grades, schedules, and other student data. This video walks through the new secure sign-on process in the student portal. Students may access the student portal by selecting Infinite Campus on their Clever portal under JCPS Resources, or by navigating to the JCPS homepage and selecting Students, and then clicking on the Logins button. Here, students will select Student Portal. On this page, students will select the Campus Student option. Although the student username and password boxes still display, Students will now select the JCPS Staff and Students Login Here button rather than entering a username and password in those boxes. Students who enter a username and password will not be logged in and rather receive a message that the Login Here button should be used. Once clicking the OK button, students will then be redirected to the login page and need to select the Login Here button to continue. Next, students will select their email address from the Pick an Account screen. Students will continue by entering their email address and selecting the Go button. Most students in grades 4 through 12 will enter their passwords and click Go. Students in grades pre-K through third grade have the option to use pictographs. Students who receive a pictograph will then be required to select the appropriate pictures to log in to the portal or can select Start Over to enter the password. Additionally, students can download the Infinite Campus app to a mobile device. We will now discuss the details of how this new process will affect students using the app. So how does it work? Students who have not logged out of the app will not have to enter login credentials to access the portal app. Students downloading the app or who have logged out prior to April 2nd will have to sign in with the process covered in this video. Then, students can choose the option to stay logged into the app and won't have to go through the sign-in process each time. Students experiencing issues with this process should reach out to their teacher or school STC. Thank you. This concludes the video on the new Student Portal Secure Sign-On process that begins April 2nd, 2024.